Welcome back to Big Bill's Garage. I'm Big Bill, your friendly neighborhood parts guy. Today I'm going to review this Ryobi uh, half inch drive impact, electric impact wrench, electric impact gun, I guess I should say. And we're going to try it out. It's got uh, three speeds on it. And I was just testing them out. There's one speed, two speed, three speed. And we're going to have a lot of fun with it today, I think. Uh, one of the fun things we used to do was hold it, just make it like do the clack a clack a thing. <laughs> Ooh. Ow. Sweet. Tested and approved. Is that on the highest setting? I don't know. Yes. Want to try it on a two or a one? Two. Two, okay. Let's see. Not so much. Nope. So three is the way to go for lug nuts, folks. What do you think? Is trail approved? Yeah. That's badass. Oh, it's got three lights on it. I just noticed that. Yeah. Nice. So you can see. Hold my nuts. <laughs> so like right above your head, I'll put the price that I paid for it on there. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Now that... Priceless. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so that was Chris's turn. Now it's my turn to give this a little shot. So we'll see how it goes with mine. I'm going to try it on the lowest setting, which is one. Okay. Two. And three. Yeah, just like Chris said earlier, it seems to be three is the magic number. All right, well, Chris and I both like this tool. This is pretty decent. I am using the two amp battery, which is uh, not what was recommended. It was recommended that you use the uh, four amp hour battery. We were able to do two tires with having the two amp hour battery. So it'd be nice to have a pinch and everything for everyday shop use like if you're going to be changing tires for a living or anything like that I don't know if you'd use it for that but this is perfect for just the mechanic that can't afford to have an air compressor or can't have an air compressor because he's renting like moi. yeah I'd give it like a let's say I'd give it like a B rating um, I really love Ryobi tools I've always liked them and it's pretty much all I have so that was a really good uh, tool and I really enjoyed it and thanks to Chris for helping me review so if you like this tool, go ahead and check it out. You can buy them at Home Depot. And once again, the price will be somewhere around my head over here. And uh, you guys have a great day. Thanks for watching Big Bill's Tool Reviews.